game is very, very loud. Very loud. Why is greens illegal? Tell me, cat. Why are greens illegal? with this naming This child, he is the one, bears the mark, <coughs> there's no mistaking it. I mean, can it sound that, tell me honest. Oh 
Oh, is that Goku? Why are they all Goku? <laughs> Why is this just Dragon Ball? I'll never did you survive? Oh, you're a jolly one. Who's this? That's Gohan. Oh, you poor thing. Like literally, that's Gohan. What? Come here. Oh, there's no need to be frightened anymore. You're safe now, little fellow. that Goku. Whoa! They put the guy from Smash in this game? <laughs> Thanks so much, you're a lifesaver. Oh, it hurts. Oh, the English dog hurts. Yeah, it's a lot. Dog. Trust me to lose my headscarf just before the big ceremony. Ah! <laughs> I can't talk. <laughs> so it's finally here, the big day. I can't believe we're going to be climbing all the way up there. I have a case of main character disease. I'm sorry. Hmm? I can laugh. Apparently, that's weird. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like Sandy's keen to lead the way. Come on, best not keep her waiting. <laughs> Come on. This game doesn't actually look that bad. In handheld mode, it looks fucking amazing. I need to change the camera. There's no fast option, really. Oof. Humble 
folk of cobblestone. Great land spirits, hearth and home. That's how it goes, isn't it? My granddad's been teaching me the prayer ever since I was little. He reckons the spirit of the land really does live on cobblestone tour, you see. As long as I can remember, he's been preparing me for this day. The day it would finally be my turn to climb all the way up there and offer my thanks. I hate this. I just wonder whose idea it was in the first place, sending the village's young folk on such a dangerous errand. What if I take a tumble and do myself a mischief? <laughs> Well, not to worry. Since you and me were born on the same day, I'm lucky enough to have a bodyguard along for the journey. Oh. Come on then. That craggy old thing won't climb its. <laughs> this <is> painful. <laughs> oh. Ah! Monsters! What? They're coming this way. It's that guy. From Minecraft. Watch out! Get him! <laughs> Shut up! Oh, dog! Crikey! Crikey! Fight, fight, and fight some more! Go on! Oh, everyone in this game sounds like Steiner, and I hate it. That's weird. Crikey! I wasn't Crikey. expecting that. Oh, I know they were only little, but I'd have been done for if you and Sandy hadn't been here to help me. <laughs> the slimes. She was frightened of slimes. And now we've got to go through that horrible, dingy cave. Just our luck. Oh, why am I not playing this I'll game? I'll bet you Jeff? anything that's where those awful things came from. Well, as long as you're with me, I've got nothing to worry about. It hurts. It hurts so much. This car is. I know they've always been like this. Oh, I hate it. <laughs> no, I'm not enjoying the English. <laughs> it's so bad. <laughs> Everyone sounds like Steiner, and it's awful. Your next keys. <laughs> it's so painful. <laughs> How's it going, my dude? I'm a good day today. I'm not. My sleep is still fucked. Go on. Fight, fight some more. Kudos, slides. It's so painful. 
get him. Crikey. Skin's gonna be fun. Skin's <laughs> gonna be fun. Also, apparently, this demo is like 10 hours long, which I'm very excited for. Oh no! Crikey! I said it by university. Holy shit, my dude! Congratulations! That's wonderful! Whatever her name is, is, is egging you on. She's going, Go on, you can do it. Get some learning in you. Oh god, it's so bad. And there's, there's an entire game of this. There's like over a hundred hours of Steiner. <laughs> oh. Now you could suffer, but you could suffer with like a monocle. That's what happens in universities, right? They all wear monocles. Group of name close to peace. Oh god. The character's inner dialogue is now Steiner forever. It's just. <laughs> Suddenly attacks. Gemma eggs you on. Bleed the beast to feed <laughs> they mostly wear monocles at you. What? Oh, at you. I, I thought you... I failed to write university then, and I was, I was... I was confused by the fact that you couldn't finish university and the fact that... University was mentioned a second time, but... It wasn't, it was just me being... weird. Need the aid of the little dance. But... fucking adorable. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Go away! Blighters, aren't they? <laughs> 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 Little blighters. Oh god, it's so bad. <laughs> and there's at least ten hours of this. Oh no, don't talk. Don't talk in this cutscene. Have this cutscene be like just. Oh no. Look at all this fog. Cool, look at all this fog. Oh, is this normal, do you think? <laughs> Help! Help me! Help me. In the trouble. Oh, I won't cut! Quick! You have to help him! Alright, Governor. Yeah. <laughs> It's a smog. It's not fog at all. It's more monsters. Or smoggy. I can't know what they're called. I played Dragon Quest before. Ah, oh, just smog. Oh, not so I played this specific game before. Crikey. Crikey. Because uh, I couldn't stop myself from playing it last night. <laughs> Don't give up, okay? They're snogs, so they're completely immune to physical attacks. Here you go. Mm. Go 
God, he looks exactly like fucking Trunks, and I hate it. Ugh, why? This is this is Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> well done. Well done, Governor. Crikey. Whoa, cut. I I'm sorry, Gemma. <laughs> I only came up here because I thought it'd be funny to jump out and surprise you. <laughs> but then those monsters appeared. What in the world is going on? I never heard anything about monsters appearing on the tour before. God, I hope it changes again. It just like suddenly changes to all the different now. colors. Whatever were you thinking? You could have been killed. You take Sardine and Rap to the village this instant. This instant. Governor? Y yes, Gemma. Sorry, Gemma. Well, cut. <laughs> you saved my bacon again. <laughs> I knew you were tough, but crikey, you really have grown into quite the hero. Well, I'm gonna start coughing blood in a second. That's <laughs> so Not painful. The top now. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> It would have to go and start raining, wouldn't it? Uh, Come on, let's get a move on. You really are a save while breaking. <laughs> Crikey. You have no idea how painful this is. <laughs> it hurts so much. You see an exclamation mark icon, and it means you can climb it, except it doesn't because I'm trying to climb it right now and it doesn't work. <laughs> I, I think the cranky counter stops existing after like the intro, because uh... Yeah, I played like four hours of this game last night. Those four hours weren't even like the intro. Like we hadn't even got to the fucking the title screen yet. Wonderful. I mean, I'm down to put like a like a a cockney counter where like they say like like cry like crimey, crikey, crimey. Criminy Chilly Jellicos Here we are at last Here we are Oh and every time they extend their R's because Oh it's It's so bad It's such a shame about the weather I was really looking forward to that view <laughs> Well we better say the pair and get this ceremony over with eh? Oh. What was that? What was that? <laughs> Crikey! <laughs> oh. Help! Oh no! Help! Oh. Help! Ah. <laughs> Whoa, I was like two FPS then. Thanks, Nintendo. So yeah. Give me that arm. This arm of mine. <laughs> he just like lets her go. <laughs> just like, I'm sorry. See, <laughs> see yourself. <clears throat> Fucking hell. Zip, stop, zam. Flash of lightning. It was almost like you made it happen. Lightning. Oh, it's so. It's so mean, it hurts. Just wait until one of the characters is y'all. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna die. Look, the mark on your hand. Huh? Oh, it stopped. 
Well, we can worry about that later. Okay. All I know is that you saved me yet again. I don't know what I'd do without you. Oh god, they should just fucking get over with. We really had better be finishing up this ceremony. They could fuck by the end of this intro, aren't they? Humble folk of cobblestone, great land spirits, hearth and home. Hearth and home. Voices up in prayer, sing it across all our drear. Blessed are we since days. Then that didn't even have an R at the end of it, and she still put an R at the end of it. What is this language? <clears throat> she said Audreyer. I hate this. <gasps> wow! Look! Oh! <laughs> I can't tell because I'm missing Tom, but. Oh. Crikey. <clears throat> Of a view. It just goes on and on and on. Just proper British, isn't it? Whoever dreamed up <clears> the <throat> ceremony must have had this in mind. <laughs> they wanted to show us how huge our world really is. How huge our world really is. <laughs> well, that's it. <laughs> it's all over, and now we're grown ups. Oh yeah, she now we're of legal age. Let's so bang, please. For us at the bottom. Okay, but like, it, it's gonna happen. We're either gonna bang out here or in the cave. <laughs> Look, I knew it. That's code for, and they they took their sweet time. Oof. Whoa, is that dungeon over there? I see. Well done, you two. Safe and sound, Grandad. <laughs> the adult ball Indeed cut. You are, <laughs> Thank the spirits for that. The chunky ball cut. When we saw lightning striking up there, we got a little worried. I have to tell you. <laughs> 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 well, I never. <clears throat> Sounds like it's nothing short of a miracle that you made it back in one piece. Also, one thing that this game is really well. Well, there's no doubt about it. The is, uh, of the land was watching over you. Conversations like this have got an automatic, which is now tell me, fantastic. How was the view from the top? I don't have to constantly press a button. I can just watch <sighs> the cutscene. I saw the sea stretch into the horizon. And the sunlight playing on the water, and oh, I've never seen anything like it in my life. My life. <laughs> You're true cobblestonians now. Only we have the pleasure of looking out over the world of Erdria in such breathtaking fashion, you know. I am still young, and the day may yet come when you decide to leave cobblestone behind. Ah, oh, that thing might come very soon. But tomorrow. Yeah, we're called Cobblestonians, I think. It's high time we were heading back. I'm sure your mother is eager to hear how things went, young man. Don't keep poor Amber in suspense. Come on, you. Home time.
But yeah, they live in a place called Cobblestone, and uh, there's cobblestone everywhere. There's actually a cobblestone path that points me to my house. Shit's great. Look at this, right? Okay. And they made this path for me. Aw, oh, this series has wonderful music, and this game is no exception. Also, hey, Cal. Look, right? Watch this, okay? This cobblestone path. Okay, it doesn't cover the entire village. It covers all the way up to me house for no reason. Why? <laughs> There's no reason. Also, everything is like open, so like buildings are part of the world now, which is fucking great. They've done such a fantastic job with this game on the Switch. Also this. <laughs> just every now and again there'll be like objects that you can just kind of like walk into and it's, it's, it's great already. <laughs> I'm loving it. Fuck these bomb games. Fuck you, woods. <clears throat> oh. Alright, Mum. Here's my little soldier. I was going. Not so little anymore. I've heard all about your big adventure. Dragon oh, Quest Builders 2 looks fucking enough. awesome, and I can't wait to buy it when I actually have money Ruby in like a week. Too much of a bother, Gemma dear. <laughs> of course not. Choose the one cousin me, brother, mum. Quite the opposite, in fact. She can fall off a fucking mountain. We got attacked <clears> by a monster <throat> at the top of the tour, and I ended up hanging onto the edge of the cliff by my fingertips. See what I mean? I thought I was done for. But you'll never guess what happened next. That mark on his hand suddenly lit up, and a bolt of lightning hit the monster. Monster. What did you say? Oh, it's <laughs> so bad. Mark? Lightning flying about the place. Goodness me. Goodness me. <laughs> Here I was hoping he'd turn out nice and ordinary. But it seems his grandfather was right all along. Oh. Well, we've been putting this off for long enough now. You and me need to have a little talk. Here. This belongs to you. They're all Steiner and it hurts. <laughs> what is this, Mum? What kind of fucking pansy shit is this? Do we? Come of age and climb to the tour. We think I am pretty princess. The truth is, there's something I've been keeping a secret all these years. Something I've never told another soul in the village. I really am a princess. It's... how can I put this now? Um... well... he said you're... You're the reincarnation of the Luminary. What in the fuck does that mean? What? <laughs> yeah, what? Oh, don't ask me what the old fool meant, dear. I haven't got the foggiest. All I know is that your grandfather said you had a special destiny and that there was something you had to do. He right, said governor. That when yeah, that's what I'm age, thinking. I'm getting extremely high Yangus vibes from this. <laughs> and show that necklace thingy to the king. <laughs> he seemed to think Air that if he open, that, be a normal protag. But in actuality, mud, I shouldn't wonder. <laughs> anyway, and see the long and short of it is that if you want to find out what this is all about, you'll have to leave Cobblestone and head over to Heliodor. Oi, mum. I'd fucking go to. Crikey. <laughs> well, I can't stop you leaving, I'm sure, but you won't be marching on an empty stomach. Come on. Dinner. Oh, dinners. 
<laughs> All right, Mum. I'll leave once we've had our steak. Our pie and chips. <laughs> our fish fingers. <laughs> I don't know. I hate this. <laughs> God, no. <laughs> Crikey. <laughs> Oh, I love it. I love it because they, this entire game is just going to be fucking just the one big excuse to do back to back Steiner. It's, it's going to be so good. Also, the introduction to this game is literally Dragon Ball. Like, Baby comes out of nowhere, Grandpa Gohan sees it, and he's like, oh, I have to raise this baby. And then he teaches it how to fight. And then it turns out I was a fucking luminary, or, you know, a Saiyan. Whoa, where's Vegeta? Where's Raditz? <laughs> also, the fact that this, like... I don't know. I just... I love this game already, and the fact that this demo is promised to be just around about the 10 hour mark makes me really excited to play the full game, and I'm gonna buy it in like 3 days. <laughs> like look, I already have the download on my Switch. <laughs> Righto. Oh, I was going, Gemma. Eh? I forgot your name for a second then. You remember this tree, don't you? Uh, not I got really. my scarf stuck in it all those years ago. Oh. There I was, crying like mad, and there you were, running round trying to help me get it down. You seen me run? Running controls just get you fucking tossed. Change, eh? You know, I always imagined we'd spend our whole lives right here in Cobblestone. Well, that was foolish, wasn't it? That's why I was so surprised by what your mum said today. All that stuff about you being the luminary, that reincarnation thing. It's a weed game. <laughs> uh, they should just fucking get over with. Well, fuck under the tree for I all I care. I don't. My granddad told me. Let's get over done with. Once upon a time, long, long ago, the world was terrorized by a horrible monster. But then, the Luminary appeared and saved the day. Oh, I don't know that. When it was that. all over, the Luminary turned into a star. And he's been watching over us from up in the heavens ever since. That's fucking junk. I don't want this star. That's his star, right there. Which one? <clears throat> <clears throat> There's lots of stars in this sky. How can you be the Luminary too? I... <sighs> I just don't get it. I know. That's what you're going to Heliodor to find out. I understand. Really, I do. Listen, we should both be getting back. Everyone will be wondering where we've got to. <laughs> Rune is your spread. <laughs> Goodbye. Let's give credence to those runes, shall we? <laughs> Exhausted, he went home and fucking slept like a rock. What a what a fucking anime protag thing to do. It's just like girls like I'm deeply madly in love with you. Don't leave. And he's just like, all right, well, it's time to fucking snooze. Can you go off the desk, cat? Like. I finally stopped being sick for like the first time in like four days, and I don't want your hair in my eyes or nose. Well, just look at you. You don't scrub up too bad, you know. Only wish your grandfather were here to see you. Mom, I'm fucking all. You won't forget him, will you? He was a fine, <laughs> upstanding man, the pride of the village. You won't forget literally your other family member, right? Well, however you 
turn out, I'm sure you'll find a way to overcome whatever lies ahead. <laughs> a mother knows these things. <laughs> oh, by the way, I've popped a little money I'd saved for a rainy day in your pack. Don't spend it all at once. Oh, pocket money. Why don't you visit the village shop before you head off to Heliodor? You'll need some supplies for your big adventure. But don't take too long. The whole village is turning out to wave you off. God, look at him. He's so fucking generic. I love him. As in, I hate him. He looks like fucking trunks, and it's weird. <laughs> Stuff stuck on the roof, right? Whoa, is that Peanut Boy Gamer? <laughs> it's a Shaggy from Scooby Doo. Can you get off the fucking desk, please? I'm gonna keep eating you until you understand that I don't want you fucking fluff in my face for the, like the first day in like a month. Just give me some space, cat, please. Wait. Oh. I thought I thought I had to find it again. I already found it. Sleeping hibiscus. Hibiscus. Boy. Also, the running controls in this game are <clears throat> awful. <laughs> Just the worst. Like, he turns so slowly. <laughs> it's it's awful. And he's faster out in the field as well, so it's just God, I love the music in this game. I promised myself the entirety of the stream wouldn't be me going, Oh, this music is so good. Oh, this game looks so pretty. Oh, I love this combat. But at the same time, it, 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 the half of it's probably going to be that. Also, something really cool. Uh, 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 fe female character. I can't remember her name. I'll spoil it now, she's making something for you, and if you look in the window you can actually see her making it, which is kind of cool, it's a nice, nice touch. Am I missing something? No, I think I got everything I got. Oh! Who? No! Also, jumping is delayed in this game. <laughs> oh, that was nice. Right, mom. I'm ready. Let's go. Wait, how'd she get here? Wait, what? She told me to go buy groceries. One day you're just a little boy, <laughs> the next you're getting ready to leave us. The, the bowl cuts. I only wish your grandfather could see what a fine young man you've become. <laughs> to think, it's been so many years already since old Chalky found you floating in a... I mean, <laughs> since he brought you to Cobblestone. We never thought there was anything out of the ordinary about you. 
<laughs> of the fact you came out of nowhere floating down a river with a knock on your hand. Nothing out of the ordinary. You know who the luminary was, of course. Uh, the legendary the hero who saved the world from a terrible darkness. <laughs> We're supposed to believe that you're him reincarnated? <laughs> I don't doubt old Chalkney, of course, but it is a little hard to swallow, I must say. Oh, when you meet the King of Heliodor, put in a good word for old Cobblestone, won't you, eh? <laughs> If he finds out this is the village where the luminary was raised, there might be something in it for us, <laughs> if you catch my drift. Huh. Oh, you are terrible. Trust you to be thinking about what you can get out of it. Oh, no. <laughs> I've been to the future in this scenario. the very thought. Anyway, where was I? There was something in it for uh, yes. No. The fate that awaits you may well be one beyond anything we simple country folk can imagine. But you must allow us to offer what little assistance we can. Take this map of Erdria with you. May it prove useful in finding your way. We just receives the map to Erdrayer. And may this magnificent steed, the pride of Cobblestone, lighten your burden and speed you on your way. Oh, I can't wait to never ride this horse ever again. You'll find Heliodor easily enough. Just head north out of the village and follow your nose. <laughs> what? You travel safely now. <laughs> follow my nose. You're such a good boy, such a good boy. You make us proud out there, won't you? And come back safe. Like, 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 like cross my eyes and just follow the direction my nose is pointing, or? Oh, who saw this coming? Is that the Here, thing from Kyron? Take this with you. I, I made it for you. No, that's the um, that's the wallet from Kingdom Hearts Two. It will keep you safe. I heard there are lots of monsters where you're going. Five thousand gil acquires. I don't know what's in store for you out there, but wherever you go and whoever you meet, don't, don't forget us, will you? I also like the fact Take that. Take care, and remember, we'll be waiting for you. These cutscenes are really hard to hear because the music is like front and center for some reason. So it's like here, have this wonderful music. Don't forget to remember <laughs> Oh yes! Horseback! Alright. <laughs> now to never ride a horse ever again. <laughs> Part of me is split on whether to stream this game on the PlayStation 4 or stream this game on the Switch. If we stream it on the PS4, this game would melt your eyes with how good it looks. But... The Switch... Is, is, is nice. And I, I can play the game in my bedroom. Seriously, the accessibility of a Switch is just, uh... It, it's ruined console gaming for me. I could easily play this game on the PS4 where it looks fucking phenomenal to the point where it just melts your retinas right out of your sockets. Or I could play it on the Switch and just be lazy. <laughs> oh 
also, I'm probably gonna go... Uh, there's like, uh, there's weapon trees in this game. Well, not weapon trees, but... There's, like, skill trees based on what weapons you want to use in this game. Which, uh, I mean, you know, if you, if you know me... I'm gonna go great swords for whatever reason. I don't think I've ever played a Monsters game. I think I have. I'm not sure. Also, listen out, because every now and again when I win a fight, the main character will go... <laughs> For no reason. <laughs> I guess the main thing for Dragon Quest on PS4 will probably be all the foliage that it can handle. Is this game on PC? <laughs> Just thumbs up. It's not on PC, right? It's only a console game? Hold on, I'm trying to Google. It seems to be on Steam? Oh shit! Also, don't buy Dragon Quest Heroes. I bought that game, and like, it, it doesn't launch on like a, a ton of computers. <laughs> Shit. 4th of September 2018. If this has HDR, I could play this game in 4K. <laughs> Yeah, I'm good. I'm gonna play on the Switch. <clears throat> I own like th three games on the 3DS that they call it over. I don't know whether one of those is a Dragon Quest Monsters game. I'll get to like level 6 and then I'll go to the castle because it's around about what level I should be. Because let's just do what color game. I don't know, they could point it to something. I, I had a friend in high school. Who played the shit out of the one on the DS. Where the like reintroduced jobs and stuff. I don't know what that was, but I know that he had like this weird bunny girl. That was weird. Nah. All right, take that. I love this sword. If okay, when we get like the the sword that's on the cover of the game, like the luminary sword, whatever it is. I hope that you can choose what kind of sword it is, because I want a great sword for the rest of the game. I don't want to... I don't want a small sword. Small swords are dumb. Ah, uh, yeah, it might be 8. If that was on the DS, then it was 8. <laughs> Dark Raven. Wait, is that a pun? It makes me think of a pun about being starving. Like I'm, I'm absolutely Stark Raven. Is that, is that saying? Is that not saying? Am I just being dumb? Oh, this game's pretty. Also, playing this makes me like. 
a thousand times more excited for Dragon Ball Z Kakarot, because uh, that game is going to be great. It's a common game. <laughs> It's already perfect. 10 out of 10. I just, to be honest, I just want an open world Dragon Ball game, which is what that looks like. My favorite Dragon Quest game was the one that was on the PlayStation 2, which had like the uh, like the king and like his daughter was a horse. And then that one was caught to the 3DS, that one's great. The Drakis are defeated. Well, true. <laughs> I oh, I love the animation of them trying to catch the fucking. Is that Pike? Or is that is that Pike or does that count as a squeer? I think Pike's are squeers, but. What is that? Is that just a squeer or is that a punk? WM2. I don't know I don't know what that is. You can have to tell me the full name of it. Oh, dra Dragon Warrior Monsters. I mean, I, I said Dragon Ball Z, but... <laughs> to be honest... I'm not a big fan of creature games. He says, having, I don't know, like 600 hours in Persona 5. I'm more traditional RPG like this, which is why I'm, I'm super excited to play this game. Like, the longer I have to wait for Sword and Shield, the less I kind of want to play it. Because I just... The only kind of raising game I like is plant raising games, like Harvest Moon, um, Harvest Moon, uh, Harvest Moon, what's the other game? Oh right, Rune Factory. Oh, and Harvest Moon. <clears throat> I don't care about the full Pokedex thing. Everyone's like, oh, I thought it won my Pokemon in the game. And it's like, but they specifically announced a service that lets you transfer Pokemon from the current, like, the current gen to the new gen. Why are you crying? Just because you can't play them in one fucking game. You cry.
Like I'm I'm all for Pokemon. I just I I can I just can't care. <laughs> I don't love Pokemon as much as other people. Oh yeah, the little fist bump and then he and then puts his thumb up. Can't test now if I play that one. What's this doing his own? I played a couple of Rune Factory games because Rune Factory is fucking great. Except I I never do any of the RPG stuff. I ah <laughs> uh, I think I played that one. That's that's got weird cutscenes. I think. One of the villagers has like amnesia, right? And then it turns out he's like a spy for like these people and then he sets like an iron golem on you like <laughs> a cool combo a huge whale I don't know huge whales huge dragons swords Slimes, <laughs> harvesting. Uh, amnesia. All, all the plots of those games bungle into one because I, I couldn't care less about the plot. I just want to sell tomatoes. The only plot of one of those games I really care about is probably Friends in Mineral Town. And even then, that's saying something because it's a Harvest Moon plot. What have we here? Well, we know a budding adventurer when I see one. I don't bud an adventurer when I see one. It could be risky turning into the great outdoors if you are familiar with the basics of survival, you know. Well, fear not, because that's, cause that's where I come in. See the remains that fire over there? Well, when you spy one of those, means you could set up camp and rest your weary bones. You settle down for the night, press the A button. Okay, beans is an illegal word in this game. Beanus is not. I don't know. Just not allowed to type it. The way he breaks corpse is, is really upsetting. Because they sometimes they just kind of break in his hand. <laughs> No, wrong button. I had for her the door. Yeah, I get that. Thanks. So what monster do we got over here? Oh. Gong, 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 gong. The normal ones, right? I'm starting to run away. <laughs> See, even if the game is not 
Wait, whoa, 4K Ultra HD. One, this still looks fucking great, and I think that's a testament to the Dragon Quest art style. And two, if the game's fucking great, I don't care what it looks like. It could look like hot piss. <laughs> also, I'm really glad that even though this is a dragon quest for the, the current generation, it, it still feels exactly the same as it always has. See, people complain about, like, Pokemon not changing anything. Dragon Quest has been exactly the same fucking name for, like... I don't know, how long, how long since the, the first, uh... Dragon Warrior came out? <laughs> They're all exactly the same game. <laughs> But they're all fucking wonderful. I mean, obviously not really. Yep. That helps you too. And, um... The menu graphics, they have changed a bit, but they still usually stay pretty much the same. As well as just just the menus and how everything works, like going to a shrine to find out how much XP you've gotten so you level up instead of it being in a menu. <laughs> that was the laugh. It's so stupid. Frog try silently. I, I barely use magic. Go away. Also, at one point during this, there's like a like an unbeatable boss fight. Um, and the monster does like like a hundred damage a hit. Uh, I have an ability right here. That gives me the chance to block attacks. I block every single one of its attacks for like half of the fight. I, I got in some good hits too. I got in some crits, which is like 30 damage. Attacking first before a monster sees you, is that... How long is that been a thing? Because that just reminds me more of Shin Megami than it does Dragon Quest. Is that a thing in this game? Or has that been a thing before? I don't remember it in... The one I played on the 3DS. There's a copy in it. It's been a while since I played that game. Oh, that might kill me then, actually. <laughs> Why heal yet? Yes, I do. I 
I can't believe the guy from Smash got his own game. It's astounding to me. Nintendo, you crazy. If only they give Captain Falcon his own game. I think that would be, be really cool. Oh no, there was a mining squat in one of the areas earlier and I forgot to get it. Shit. Okay. Rip. I'm so angry. And you're not to level 6, you coward. Because you're gonna laugh. Oh. You didn't go. <laughs> Look, it's a platypunk. Ah! I can tell that I'm gonna sink a shit ton of time into this game. See? I wanted to play Pokemon Vietnamese Crystal, and I also want to play Toy Story. I was going to play Toy Story 2 tomorrow, but depending on how long this demo lasts, I'm probably not going to have time for it. This game comes out. Uh, it comes out on the 27th, so it comes out in five days. I get paid in four days. And I'm not here this weekend, so that only leaves tomorrow and possibly Monday. Wait. What day is Monday? Yeah, Monday is the 26th. Right. See, this is why we don't get a new Chrono Trigger game. Or just a Chrono game. Imagine this, right? They use this engine, okay? And they do they do the first non-shitty thing that they've done in a while. And they're like, oh yeah, let's remake Chrono Trigger in the fucking Dragon Quest XI engine. I would die. Not even considering it to be a possibility, but it'd be funny. It'd be not, it'd be cool. Do what Xenoblade did and just have like a completely separate universe.
Because that's what Xenoblade Chronicles 2 did. Because the end of Xenoverse 1... Well, Xenoblade 1... Is, uh, it's just that, like, the whole universe is, like, a weird fake dream thing. And then Xenoblade 2 is like, okay, we're now in the sky. To be honest, I mean, we already have the Akira Toriyama art style, like, it wouldn't... I mean, I don't know that much about game production, but, like... At least you could use some, like, reuse some of the assets, like the foliage and... The building architecture is quite similar. Look, right? You stick some you stick some tits on this character and <laughs> Oh god, no no mind. You got fake bomber. <laughs> What a nice, cool breeze! Oh, you had to sell? Oh, no, never mind. Ah, my cat is stuck up on the roof. That's just fucking- that's just and makeup blonde and that's android. Oh my god, Akira, please. Get, get some- I don't know, get some new haircuts. You... <laughs> Hold on. Hold on, wait a second. So I wanted a list of all the all the uh, the Chrono Trigger characters because I wanted to compare a bunch of them. And um, you've got Chrono, you've got Magus, you've got Ayla, you've got Luca, and then you have Mother Brain. <laughs> I just keep drawing the same characters. They keep giving me money. What am I supposed to do now? Correct me if I'm wrong, but uh, uh Mo Mother Brain, uh, that's uh. That's from Zelda, right? <laughs> Why is Mother Brain here? <laughs> Mother Brain, it takes me to the fucking. Wiki Nature Wiki.
<laughs> what luck! Beatus was the little. Beatus gratefully pockets his fold. Thank you, cat. Meow. Meow. I was thinking memes could have to do meow. <laughs> So that is he says to thee. Check it out. Fallen <laughs> ancients, all of you. to read one of these books. What oh, grants for Kirby? Oh yeah, you're right. Cheek, that's private. <laughs> oh! That's where I get the stockings from. <laughs> that's illegal. <laughs> hey, you didn't know the rook on the roof, did you? And you just get out the swaggy part of town. Or just walk there. What? Sorry for your serious off the notes now. Good mind clearing all. Also, do you guys see that I, I finally reached level 50 in Skyrim? Like... Holy shit, that took me a while. I'm so proud, but also, what the fuck else is there to do? Because my character is still made of paper. And I can't stop him from being made of paper, because I can't level up anymore at all. I don't know what Chrono Cross's art style looks like. Wasn't that like bootleg Akira Toriyama designs? <laughs> It was like not quite Toriyama. Chrono Cross characters. Chrono, Luca, Magus. Um, uh, mm, what? <laughs> Google. This is, this is um... Why is there a skeleton clown? I'm on a preface this. I've never played Chrono Cross. Why is there a skeleton clown here? <laughs> Why is there a skeleton clown? Oh, what is the art style on this game? It looks like fucking shit. The character profiles are so bad. Scarecrow by the looks of it. And a mushroom man. <laughs> what the fuck? Wow, 
Right, let's go get some ammo before this next section. Haha, <laughs> I'm gonna walk all over your nice clean water. Name's Andre of Astora. I find one of those later on, don't I? I had a dream about this game and the small amount of sleep I had today. Why is there two separate doors? There's like one door. Copper chopper? Something to sell. Why? Give me the copper chopper. So, proper whopper. Looks like shit now. Cobblestone sword looks way cooler than the fucking copper sword. Alright, let's have a quick jealous charm. Hold on. That's the wrong button. Also, one thing that kind of upsets me a little bit is. the inventory system, but well, I'm gonna get used to it, is the fact that like each character has their own inventory and then you have to put items from the item bag into the inventory. It's it's dumb. It's a double opening door. Let's right, go see the king. Oh, you want information about a story, except I went and already read it, so here you go. Beatus accepts the soldier and the strategist to tailor two heroes. Ah, oh, to go find it again? Wow. BRB. Berg. I wish I was here this weekend, because then we'd had time for more games, but... My father rang me up today and was like, hey, do you want to hang out? Is that okay? So... Tammy, I need to get the shopping done. Whee! <laughs> uh, I should have waited until I got the shilling, because that's specifically so that you can sell it. Once we reach this next section, it's the extent of as much as I've played of this game. No, that's a Siege of Sorcery. Wait. Wait 
a second. I'm supposed to find a, a seed that increases my health at some point. Oh well. Must have missed it. <laughs> That's it's the Steiner, but it's also the halt. Steiner. Not so fast. State your business. Beatus explains that he's a luminary that he's come to speak to the king. <laughs> Here, shake my hand, mate. That's the funniest one I've heard all week. Clear off, will ya? We haven't got time for this kind of nonsense. I showed you that beat of a squeeze or two. What's that? You wanna show that pendant to the king, you say? Do you mind waiting here a minute? So sorry for that little misunderstanding. Please, go right on through. His Majesty's waiting for you. Oh, cool. I don't see how anything bad could happen at all. No. Not in any way, shape or form. There's nothing in these places either, unless we want some extra gold and some extra healing herbs, so... Yeetus! Look, it's the king, and definitely not a bunch of evil men. God, they even look like they're gonna start trying to kill me anytime soon. That will be quite close enough. Welcome to Heliodor Castle, friend. This is the Dark Souls Dragon Quest. Oh, it's at Orlando. The jewel of Dundrasil. You are bold indeed to have made your way here alone, wanderer. I am Carnelian, ruler of Heliodor. How long have I waited for this day? And now, finally, we meet. Truly, it is an honor. The fact that you come here proffering the jewel and asking to speak with me personally would suggest that you know something of your true nature. No, that's why I came here. Also bear the mark. I don't know anything about myself, which means he could have told me that I'm not the luminary and it's just a coincidence and nothing would have happened. Yes. But no. The mark of light. <laughs> then there is no doubt. You are he. I will give the game this credit, this Rejoice, dude. Dear subjects. The day is upon us at last. This dude the doesn't walks among immediately us look more. like big evil man. He just kind of looks like a king. Tell me, O oh Luminary, where exactly is it that you hail from? Oh God! I would so very much like to pay tribute to those who took you in and raised you. Mm-hmm. Now I know, without a doubt, this governor was loyal. Venus tells King Carnalian that he hails from the land far away called Cobblestone. Cobblestone, you say? Jasper, you know of this place? I do, my liege. A village of provincial nobodies deep in the rocky south. Wow, nurse and ruin, someone started playing Smash Bros. Then I take it you know what to do. Do not disappoint me. 
Yes, my liege. He's so fucking evil. But he's so hot. I wanted to beat my cobblestone. A cursed luminary. He's slightly less hot because he looks like me. <laughs> he's got my beard. <laughs> He's got my eyebrows. <laughs> Hendrik, take this cur, this harbinger of calamity, and cast him into the furthest corner of the dungeon. Whoa, how many R's did that this, corner have? The luminary is the root of all evil and will bring naught but misery to our realm. Alright. And why is this? The reason is simple. Just as light is intertwined with darkness, so too is the luminary intertwined with the dread lord of shadows. His coming heralds the resurrection of the Dark One. Did you really think you could fool one as wise as his majesty? It was your great misfortune to confront one who knows your true nature. <laughs> what? Men, seize this wretch. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> I became an adult like two days ago. <laughs> Chill. Fuck. There are rocks, ropes, ladders, and ledges that you can climb up into. Oh, okay. Oh, are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready for the character that makes me cringe every time he talks? Because he's just... Oh, he's... Our oh, true nature. Men! We can't have a faggot in our midst. No! I'm sorry! You're all so hot! It's just like light and darkness. Darkness is evil and so light is also evil. You claim to hail from Cobblestone. Well, before the sun has set three times, we shall know the truth. Three times? Uh, uh, By then, uh, Jasper will have returned from his investigation. Why three? Uh, if I were you, Darkspawn, I would not expect to live beyond that day. Why three times specifically? <laughs> can we get the, uh, can we get the intro music to Oblivion? And the final hours of my life. Do 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 I'm sorry, but nobody can convince me that that is like the best intro to any game ever. Like that nothing sets up fantasy vibes in the intro to fucking oblivion. Open up! Click it down, will you? Because it goes to the road. Oh, can see. Will you keep it down in there? Oh, no. Most folks they throw in here have the decency to wait a while before going stir crazy. Ah, oh, his voice. What are you in for, anyhow? You don't get free bed and board down here without having done something pretty bad. <laughs> Wait, did you say the luminary? Yes. You're serious? Yeah. <sighs> Please stop talking. You're telling me the luminary has just shown up in the cell next to mine. This is crazy. <laughs> this is madness. <laughs> Where's that? One plate of delicious gruel for a gentleman in the dungeon suite. The fuck is, is it green soup? <laughs> what? Did you just fucking punch him through the bars? Okay, but you're gonna eat that green soup because. Kinda hungry.
The luminary. You're serious? Oh, I hate fucking voice. It's really so hot. When I hate his voice, it's so hot. <laughs> so it's all happening just like the seer said it would. We'd better get out of here. Wait here. You, but I like how he was holding the sword, like like one of those kids where like he thinks it's in a scabbard. Don't worry, I didn't kill him. But, but he won't be waking up anytime soon. It wasn't. <laughs> Things will get pretty hairy up ahead. You'd better take this. Oh God, I hate your voice. Could you not be voiced by Goku or something? Wait, is that Goku? Oh, and I found this in a corner over there. I guess it's your stuff, right? Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> Me? I got this little beauty back, so now I'm pretty much unstoppable. Ah. Uh. We better get out of here before any more of our tin-headed friends come knocking. Hollow, when you're ready to move out, okay? It just hurts. It just hurts a lot. <laughs> Weepy. Do you want to get caught or something? There's too many guards that way. Stick with me. It's like none. So I've got that green soup. Can I have it? Like, what did you do with the green soup? Hey! <laughs> I love this lively face of Gondon for some reason. Oh. I spend ages digging this hole, and you just happen to show up the day I finish it? Heck of a coincidence. I guess I really was meant to help you out, just like the seer said. Anyway, there'll be time to talk about all that later. In you go! <laughs> Yeet. Oh, this game, you know what? This game actually just like really, really good on the Switch. <laughs> no. The sewers, huh? Well, there must be a way out somewhere. Lead the way. I heard, I heard Dio's English voice a couple of days ago from to Captain in the Final Fantasy XIV. Oh. Two of them? Like generic cat men? Because there's, there's also cat people that are very specific to the plot. <laughs> Nino Kuni 2. Alright, oh, that's a game I wanted to play at some point. But, you know. I'll play the first one as well. Also, yeah, Dio's voice actor in English is... Oh, it's so bad. I cannot hear Dio in English. And the worst part is, is that he's a really good voice actor, because he's uh, he's the voice actor for English Irons Algon from Overlord. But just... Oh, just... Just hearing it in Dio, is just, it's awful. Follow my lead. Yeah, I like a good idea to avoid the guards. 
<laughs> I stand for you, Dark Swan. Don't worry, we didn't kill them. You can see them still breathing. Oh! Over there is a stealth oh. section. So essentially, I just ignored the stealth section, just went and fought them. <laughs> <sighs> <sighs> I love how in Nino Kuning 2 you just straight up plays the fucking king of the United States of uh, King? The president of the United Seriously? States of America. Like, oh, like Nino Kuni 1, it's, it's all like a big allegory about like losing loved ones and stuff. And you just you just a kid. You just a kid in a town that's trying to come to grips with the fact that his mom just had a heart attack. And then the second one is just oh yeah, you're the president of the United States and you use a gun in a fantasy world. <laughs> the gun hasn't learned it handle, by the way. Looks like we shook the guards at least. <laughs> it's just wait it's, it's just the president of the United States wandering around in fantasy world with a fucking handgun. And that looks like a way out. Maybe our luck's about to change. Man. Imagine if we were playing Dragon Quest. And we run a quest to get out of here. And we just happen to maybe fight a dragon. Just, just a possibility, you know? Could happen. Oh, wait, what's that? Whoa, is that what I think it is? Wait, there's something there. Also, in this cave, there's like really weird... Reaver. Also, yeah, okay. The people make guns for him. Like, he gives them his handgun and they like they upgrade it. So these like fantasy blacksmiths know how to make handguns now. Let's get the heck out of here. Come on, we need to move now. Let's get out of here. You see that dragon go like <laughs> I just made a really weird noise. <laughs> well, here goes nothing. <laughs> Slip. Huh? <sighs> I spoke too soon. Oh, yeah, and squeaky too soon um, is going to be a, a common, common trend for a, a little bit, by the way. Come on, quickly! 
and he's, he's gonna he's gonna do that a couple of times. He's gonna be like, oh, I shouldn't have said anything, or, or I said that too soon. <laughs> oh, this game's silly, and I love it. <laughs> Also, Dragon Quest Dragons, I, I fucking love their designs. Because the dragons and like stuff like the bigger monsters are like peak Toriyama. As it goes in like half of Toriyama's work, he just he just loves to put like a, a giant like dinosaur or a dragon in there for no reason. Well, whatever. We should get going. Oh, are you ready? He's gonna say that everything's fine, and then he's gonna go, oh, oh no, shouldn't have said anything. Uh oh. Run! What? I'm 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 having a wonderful time right now. We made it. Just I don't know how much more of this I can take. This game is gonna be great. There he is! That dark spawn. Oh, is he gonna do it? Is he gonna say it? Ah, me and my big mouth. Whoa. Move now. <laughs> I know how you can put that big mouth to you. I'm uh. Mm. What? Look at my anime hands. Looks like our luck finally ran out. What do you mean finally ran out? We just got chased by a dragon. We were put in jail before that. And then after that, it tried to set us on fire. <laughs> what part of this is luck? No way back, huh? You fucking nerd. They catch us, we're dead meat. <laughs> Hold. Let's do this. I believe in you. I believe in the luminary. I don't have much choice. Come on, let's not do anything stupid now. <laughs> oh, he's so hot. The name's Eric, by the way. <laughs> oh, right. Now the game has started. <laughs> that was just the tutorial. When you walk away, you don't hear me say, Please, oh me, don't go. <laughs> I'm sick of all his boyfriends. There's that one. Not that one. Definitely not that one. That one. His daddy on the side.
all three of them at once. God, this intro just screams adventure. I love it. Why is there a lolly? Is this a ball? <laughs> Cal help. Sounds like a bot. <laughs> Come on, up you get. Finally. I was worried we'd lost you for a minute there. You've been out cold ever since we jumped. Had to drag you all the way here on my own. <laughs> and what a jump it was. <laughs> I closed my eyes, put my faith in the luminary, and somehow didn't get smashed into a thousand pieces. <laughs> in fact, I woke up on the forest floor at the bottom of the cliff without a scratch on me. Imagine what a little faith can do. Hello, I am Watch Your Stream Super Saiyan Dio Brando. Anyway, I guess you and me must be at the top of the King of Heliodor's most wanted list by Big now. Damn, it's demo time. Dragon Which Quest XI is so good. I am about Let's to make animated BRB for your channel, right. you. <laughs> Please look at my profile to get a link. Oh my god. Eric is cool, but I hate his voice. Ah, there you are, my children. I trust that your friend here is fully recovered. Oh, don't worry about him. He's just fine. He's like... Thanks for looking out for us. We owe you one. He's like developing some sort of like weird like Brooklyn not accent, all, but like not I'm really. I'm just happy to see you both well again. But if you are leaving, you must be careful on the road. It seems it's like tourist Brooklyn. Dangerous criminals have escaped from the capital and are at large somewhere in the area. Oh, I shudder to think what wicked deeds they might be capable of. Criminals, you say? Dear me, that doesn't sound good. And you heard this when you were in Heliodor. I did indeed, my child. There were guards everywhere. They are searching high and low for the villains. And I heard that the mighty knight Sir Hendrik himself has headed to the mountains in the south with his troops. They say he means to block the road to Cobblestone, the village the fugitives came from. Eric, I didn't know you were from Cobblestone. 
Why didn't I see you there? But you must forgive me, poor lambs. I did not mean to alarm you. God is here. Be caught, I am sure. His fucking hair. Justice will be done. And until then, you are free Wait. to remain with us for as long as Oh you my please. god, Toriyama, please. Thanks. <sighs> we appreciate that. That's Super Saiyan 2 hair. That's that's literally the model for Super Saiyan 2. We're going to get a little fresh air. We have a few things to discuss, right? Uh, you want to grab the robot? So it wasn't that it wasn't a robot, or maybe it was a robot. Um, um. Cobblestone, eh? Never heard of the place. I never even knew anyone actually lived in those mountains down south. <laughs> Is that really where you're from? I'm guessing you want to go see what's happening down there. But you need to be smart. You won't get past Hendrik unnoticed. <laughs> if you're going to make it there without getting caught, you'll need to avoid the main road. I hate his voice. And if you want to do that, you'll need my help. I know every back road there is to know in these parts. But I've got things to take care of in Heliodor first. I left a little something in one of my old haunts downtown, and I need to get it back. So, are you coming along for the ride? I did help you break out of that dungeon, remember? <laughs> Can I say no? Come on, don't be like that. I just need to pop back to town and grab it real quick. After that, I'll show you the scenic route to Cobblestone. So, are you coming along for the ride? I did help you break out of that dungeon, remember? That's the spirit. But we can't have you bringing us any unwanted attention. Ah, I've got just a thing. Can I grab some gloves? Like... Here, put this on and keep your face hidden. Wouldn't it Otherwise make sense? you're gonna get nabbed as soon as you set foot in Heliodor. Can I wear some gloves? That's more like it. If you're gonna be a wanted man, you might as well look the part. <laughs> right. Let's head north and hit town. Glad you're coming along. The seer told me to stick with the luminary when I found him, and that's just what I'm going to do. I hate him so much. Eric could beat his joy forces. Later that evening, we need to sellotape Derek's mouth shut. Yo, but Axel has good voice acting. Well, where is this lady? That's a man, not a lady. She's wearing a bike helmet. So Gluey Chapel you is called Eric, is he? Well, he looks like he knew how to handle himself. He could pick a worse traveling companion, that's a sound. You heard of pet powers? Yeah. Whoever wants to defeat a monster with Eric using a pet power known as the real decoy. Okay, I'm down. Takes two to tech though. I think I'm currently boosted, right? Yes, I am. Let's go.
classic camera? What's a classic camera? How do I... Does Eric have to be punked up? Through the associated animations, so we don't know the attributes in the new. Let's cut to some cup cuts, get a wheel, so everyone involved is in this state. So, right, we will no longer be packed up once the powers were performed. Obviously, quite happy to disclose it all. Must be prepped. Oh, okay, sweet. That's not gonna happen in a while. I lose pep this this round. Oh no, I don't. I mind them. Usually when it flashes, and these crap just got to run out. Why would you not love Locker's knives? I still don't understand how to get Pip. It says when... Certain conditions in that. What, what does that mean? Sleepy, which is actually really, really good because my sleeping pattern has been fucked. So I might take this opportunity to just call it a night and go to sleep, hopefully. You know what? Toy Story is going to happen tomorrow. I, I really want to play Toy Story. As childish as that sounds, Toy Another Story 2 on the PlayStation the 1. No! <laughs> Toy Story 2 on the PlayStation 1 is like my favorite game of 
well, not necessarily my favorite game, but one of my favorite platforms. Look like an a uh, question mark. Then. There it is. <laughs> Toy Story 2 is quite possibly one of my favorite movie tie-in games. Also, okay, people talk about movie tie-in games, but nobody ever mentions the Harry Potter games. And I know they're also based on books. But the Harry Potter games are fucking just awesome. <laughs> yeah, thumbs up. Thumbs up. But you know, sir, see the three skin points. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Like, Harry Potter 1 for the PlayStation 1 like, wasn't bad. Actually, that game was brilliant. And then, uh... Chamber of Secrets, uh, Prisoner of Azkaban, and... Uh, uh, Order of the Phoenix on GameCube were fucking great. Although I played them on PlayStation 2. Which I don't know if they're different. Because the other one on the PlayStation 2 was a bit more epic. Oh, right. What was I just saying? I don't know what I was just saying. It had something to do with this. I don't know what it was. Never mind. Oh, I'm excited. This game's great. I don't know why I did that. I get to play this all weekend just because it's got like 10 hours and I'm gonna beat it and then I'm gonna restart and I'm gonna beat it again and I'm gonna restart. I'm gonna beat it again until it comes out because this game is great and I've been waiting. I don't know, when did this game originally release? Like 2017, right? I've been waiting since 20. I've been waiting longer than that. I've been waiting so long to play this game. And then, like, it didn't come to this country for like a year, two years. And then they're like, hey, when they get a Switch version, I was like, oh, okay, I guess I'll wait for that one. Like, okay. I remember they showed footage of this back when the Switch first came out. But they showed they showed the classic texture because you you can play this game in in 3D in Dragon Quest mode. You can play this game in 2D mode. And I remember they showed it in 2D mode, and I thought it would be like another situation of like. Like Final Fantasy XV, where the, they had the mobile version, and then they had Fi Final Fantasy XV, and Switch got the mobile version, which is really upsetting. And I thought we were gonna get like a diet version of Dragon Quest XI, which I would have lost my mind over, but it looks like it's just Dragon Quest. It's fun hype. It's a demo. And it also makes me think of candy. Oh, you just own the software in order to play it. Yeah, but... It's not out yet. I don't have any money. Oh, right. I've seen you playing these games recently. Hold on. Have you seen... Uh, where is it? Wait, what? 
Yu-Gi-Oh. Oh shit. There you go. <laughs> Grandi HD collection. <laughs> and it looks like piss. That doesn't. But the 2D one to HD looks like piss. And I hate it. It looks so bad. Two Gaelic Legend returns. What have you been playing Grandia recently? Well, what have you been playing recently? It's an RPG series game. Every time I go onto Steam, I keep seeing you playing a game. I can't remember what it is, but I know it's a game that I've wanted to play for a while. I thought it was Grandia. Oh, yeah. So it has nothing to do with this game series. Looks weird. Looks like Stardew Valley. <laughs> what? What are these screenshots? Okay, it's just taken from Stardew. <laughs> Oh, I get it. It's grindier because. <laughs> oh, so online. Oh, yes. No, thank you. Wait, isn't this that ghost game? Oh, it is! It's the game with stands! I wanted to play this. Why, why did we not... Why did they not tell us it was coming out? Who made this? What company made this? Tokyo RPG Factory. Well, they just, they just clump them out? Squeenix? Why would you not... Tell us? You bastards. Look at these wonderful games. You got a Squall Uncle Party and Final Fantasy XV Quark Edition. Oh, look how good it looks! It looks fucking awful! <laughs> they need. They need, uh. Final Fantasy 7, whoa, look at that, Square Enix made this, except they didn't. Squaresoft made this. I'm pretty sure nothing remains of Squaresoft anymore. It's turned into shit. Oh, that's what I wanted to show. Okay, alright. You've played Skyrim, obviously. Have you ever seen Lava? In Skyrim. In base Skyrim. Like, okay, okay, right, we, we have like, uh, I've got like 10 minutes before I leave. Let, let me show this. I'm not going to change the game title, it just could be like a two minute section. This is the, uh, I found 
the most non-Skyrim part of Skyrim I've ever seen before, and it's it's base game. It's not even DLC, which confused me. This is why, like, playing this game at a level level a hundred. Well, yeah, level fifty. Joel saves. No, yeah, this one. Right. Remember when we were playing in VR, and we found that weird like tablet thingy. Like the little, like crescent moon blue tablet thing. Well, I found the quest for it. I found the actual. I found the origin. And it has like a ghost lady. It's kind of cool. But um, I I I need to save because I really wanted to show someone this because I I never seen this before. You know when the loading screen happens. All right, yeah, ignore Cicero for like a minute because he's gonna be doing weird stuff. Okay, what one thing, Ghost Follower Lady, she's just here. And then you have cool stuff like this, which is like a giant Dwemer Museum. Oh, come on. There you go. Also, these things, I've never seen this used before. Underground mushroom place. No. No, we're not. This is the Ethereum Forge. Look at this. Ow. And it's the first and only time I've ever seen lava in Skyrim. It's so weird. Let's see if we can't. <laughs> oh no, Cicero! Oh god! And, like, we get to make, like, a cool stuff. Actually, a bunch of stuff. There's one that lets you keep permanently any uh, d uh, divine blessing that you get from one of the nine divines. Um, there's something else that I can't remember. And then there's a staff, and the staff spawns, straight up spawns, um, uh, Duenna Centurions. Oh, so I got this cool bow. Yeah, I just, I've never seen anything like it. Like, we, we discovered the vomiting people. I still need to do that quest line. I, I actually found some infected people in one of the uh, uh, Dwemer caves that I had to find for this quest. 
and uh, yeah, they just start vomiting on me. So I need to find that quest. Skyrim is still surprising me. This this long in. Like, how many hours am I into this game? 70. So not that many. Still something, though. What a disappointing game. Alright, well, that's the end, my dude. I give you all know watching, so I'll just say goodnight to you. Uh, until, well, I'm gonna start uploading these vlogs. So, maybe other people will watch this. So, if you made it this far into the shitty YouTube video that is this stream memes, yeah, get out, my dude. I will see you probably tomorrow, unless you're busy. I know I won't, because I'm playing fucking Toy Story, because that game is great. I can't wait to hear Buzz Lightyear for like six straight hours go, Oh! 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 Ah, oh. oh. memes. I'm hungry. I'm gonna go get some food. Yeet.